in various clinical trials, Japanese subgroups show the better survival trend compared with outside Asia, even in outside Japan. The reason of this better outcome has not been clearly identified, but one of the major reasons is subsequent line of therapy. In Japanese treatment guidelines stated, first line should be ropinibidin plus platinum, and second line weekly paclitaxel plus lamsirumab, and later in the third line, sequential use of nivolumab in rotecan or tax 102. In this situation, the randomized phase three keynote 062 study was reported. This is designed to compare the efficacy and safety of Pembro alone or in combination with cisplatin fluoropyrimidine, with those of cisplatin fluoropyrimidine as first line therapy of PDL1 positive has negative advanced gastric cancer or G junction adenocarcinoma. And pembrolizumab monotherapy showed the non inferiority compared with cisplatin gene 5 fu chemotherapy, but these two survival curves were crossed. And Japanese regulatory authority and FDA did not approve first-line pembrolizumab. And next slide is SORA trial. SORA trial was the phase three study of TAS-118 plus oxaliplatin versus S1 plus cisplatin in patients with advanced gastric cancer. In per protocol set, median OS of TAS-118 plus oxaliplatin showed statistical significant OS improvement with 16.0 months in TAS-118 plus oxaliplatin and 15.1 months S1 plus cisplatin arm with hazard ratio 0.83. But in ITT analysis, TAS-118 plus oxaliplatin could not show the survival benefit. So our Japanese regulatory authority do not approve this regimen. So our first line standard is still S1 plus oxaliplatin or S1 plus cisplatin. And the position of IO, uh, mainly nivolumab, is sardine or later. 